Ah, uh, vacation. A trip on the river. A ride on your bike. Maybe a hike on a forest trail. Or how about planting a tree? We had about, I think probably about 40 volunteers in total out on the trail um, planting trees. These volunteers are actually vacationing in the Willamette National Forest, having a naturally good time working. They've signed up for a new category of trips. Regenerative tourism is just leaving a place better than you found it. Elisa Archer is the executive director of Cascade Volunteers. They are one of several partners arranging outings for tourists meant to help reclaim the land. In September 2020, Oregon suffered from wide-ranging wildfires. The Holiday Farm Fire in southern Oregon burned homes and towns. It also destroyed business for guides and places that depend on tourism. And we were thinking, okay, you know, there are these gateway communities on the Mackenzie River corridor, and they are really reliant on tourism. Um, and we knew that, you know, we needed to get folks into those communities. Groups and businesses have joined together with money from Travel Oregon's Destination Ready program program to create this new kind of vacation. Regenerative tourism is about going to a place and doing something to make it better than you found it. Travel can make a difference and make a positive impact. Kieran Widener Wild with First Nature Tours held its first regenerative trip in mid-April, planting trees. Coming up in May, August and September, excursions will focus on trail fixes, repairing signs and working on mountain bike trails. I think that the story we're telling and the model that we're creating for this kind of tourism is really the, the important part of what we're doing. Okay, it's not all work. For $775 per person, there's rafting, hiking, and biking mixed in. Plus, all your transportation, lodging, gear, and food are included. The memories come as part of the package. They're signing up for these projects that they can come back to in 10 years with their kids or their friends and say, hey, I planted that tree, or, you know, I helped build this trail and restore it from the damage of the wildfire. People are anxious to get out from their isolation. The forest will need to be ready, thanks in part to its visitors. Yeah, yeah. hopefully we'll see you on the trail sometimes. I'm Stephen Redland, KGW News.